Proverbs uh, chapter 11, verse 30 says, The fruit of the righteous is a tree of life, and he that winneth souls is wise. So many of us thinking we are going to make heaven the way the journey that we are on. You're not going to make heaven that way. You got to do the work of God. You're not even being a disciple. So don't be fooled by that. Oh, what I'm doing, I think I'm doing great. No, you better look at God's word, break it down, apply it to your life so you can be the disciple that he is calling. Amen. The soul winner that he is calling. Jesus went about all Galilee, teaching in the synagogues and preaching the gospel of the kingdom and healing all manner of sickness and all manner of disease among all people. He showed them that you got to get off, you'll do nothing and go. He showed them that. Jesus wants us to learn the art of disciple making. One day they can see God. One day they can hear him say, well done, my good and faithful servant. It's because of what you imparted in their life. When you meet them, it's not just meeting them and turning them loose. It's a lifelong process. Even when they say they got it, you still there if they got questions. What message are we sharing? Are we sharing to people repent? Because the kingdom of God is at hand. People who was tormented with devils, huh? They're supposed to be brought to us because we are disciples and all power is in us to deal with devils. too bad for us now. The fruit of the righteous is a tree of life and he that winneth souls is wise. There's something in that. Because we go out and invite people and invite people. But are we doing it under the unction of the Holy Ghost? Huh? I want to ask you that question. Is God leading you? Because that's going to be the difference. That's what's going to make a change here right where we are, y'all. And right among every other church. What is the motive behind your invitation? Huh? Are you doing it because you want to be seen? Huh? Are you doing it for a pet on the back? What is your motive? And God knows your motive behind your invitation. Is it spiritual? Because if it's spiritual, they gonna be transformed. Oh my God, hallelujah. Huh? I'm talking about making disciples, hallelujah. You're gonna, you're gonna touch somebody with your invitation, it's gonna be so genuine that they gonna connect with you and they're gonna never depart from you. What are you doing it for? Some of you are doing it to be seen. Heard of. Look at me. You got the wrong motive. Because if they trust in you, right? But you got the wrong motive. Do you not know what you're doing to them people? That's their soul. And you're not concerned about their soul. The devil is a liar.